I have built a simple charger that allows me to charge my phone as well as my Bluetooth audio headset at work. The purpose of the silver box that you are seeing here is to provide a constant 5 volt source through USB connectors for the phone and the headset to charge. Now a bit about the way the system was built. There is a LM338 adjustable voltage regulator rated at 5 amps that is providing regulated voltage from two parallel connected lithium ion battery blocks, each containing three cells connected in series. The output of the LM338 is controlled by Atmega 328 microcontroller. Using implementation guidelines from Voltage Regulators datasheet, I was able to turn off the output of the voltage regulator using a simple TTL signal from the microcontroller. And yes, I know that it does not shut down completely. There is still approximately 1.25 volts going to the USB socket. In previous version of this controller, I was powering the microcontroller from the LM338 regulator and that caused a lot of problems. If serious load is connected to the USB port, voltage suddenly dropped and the microcontroller rest restarted. I solved this by using a separate LM7805 linear voltage regulator that, uh, that is powering the Atmega328 and uh, using LM338 only for USB and making this modification allowed me to use TTL shutdown. The microcontroller measures voltages of each of the cells in the battery pack and if any of them drops below 3.2 volts it shuts down the USB ports. Voltage, voltages are measured using built-in ADC via voltage dividers. I used LEDs to display the current voltage of the battery pack. Each LED represents 0.4 volts and the lowest value is 9 volts. All the LEDs are connected through 1 kilo ohm resistors and that means that current flowing through each of them is really small. It's approximately 2 milliamps. Uh, the rest of this video is going to be the show of, of how the system was built. Enjoy!